We're here at the brand new home of the National Safety Council, and we're going to get a sneak peek because they don't open for another week or so. But I'm meeting Mr. Ray inside, so let's go on in. The South Carolina National Safety Council, we're a nonprofit organization really focusing on defensive driving, emergency care, and occupational safety and health for the state of South Carolina. So when we started to look at purchasing a building and we wanted to make sure that it had a training environment that mm -hmm. would be conducive for people to come in and learn and be educated to hopefully save lives in our state. Well, Brooke, can you explain to us what all this is that we're looking at here? Well, one, it's my chicken scratch, but <laughs> you know, this is this is what I call my Alive at 25 board that really represents what's going on and what has transpired in the state of South Carolina for the past uh, four years. The one side that really devastates us at the council on a daily basis is over there in the corner where you see fatalities. Out of the 36,000 kids, young adults that have gone through this program thus far, we've had 10 fatalities of graduates. And, you know, we, we don't look at it as, oh, it's just another person. It's a name. It's Samuel, it's Jonathan, it's Blake, it's Michelle. Although we say we're doing a lot and we're saying that we're saving lives, well, as long as I'm still having to put a name up there like Samuel that lost his life and he had taken the Alive at 25 program, I've got something more to do and so does the council. In the whole entire time that we've been doing this, there, there's there been a lot of people that have stepped up and have helped us and have given us the resources, but there's one person in particular that regardless of what happens and what I ask, he's there day in, day out. But he hasn't seen what we're calling the Harold Ray Conference Room. <laughs> you gotta get the expression. I recognize, oh, I recognize that picture. <laughs> well, there's a whole bunch over here on the wall because I already got to look. Oh my heavens. <laughs> well, as you can imagine, this is a this is quite a surprise, and, and I just, I don't know that I've ever felt, I've ever been more honored about anything. I, I just, um, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I don't know what to say, I'm kind of speechless <laughs> a little bit, you have to forgive me. You're looking at four and a half years worth yeah. of stuff here. You know, I mean, from Mr. Ray, you remember the very first press conference we had in 2007 right there? to the Dutch Fork High School when we had them on the uh, your commercial back in 2007. We've got prom safety 2008. You know, we've got 2011 when you received the honor from the Sheriff's Department because of your participation. I mean, we've got every single benefit dinner that you've been through. Let's look at the, the Be a Zero Hero right right there of our goal of zero one life lost is one too many that was i mean that's mr ray you know honestly can't say enough for people in the community and especially businesses to pick that phone up or take a moment and see what they can how they can participate doesn't have to be a gargantuous thing <laughs> yeah. just participate and and know what it's about. <laughs> Thank you.